Hey, welcome to the Sarah Show. It is July 26, 2009. I checked for you. So, I'm still here. And there seems to be dead ladybugs all over the top of my car. And there was one that was crawling on my arm. And I was like, oh, should I kill it or should I let it go? I decided to be nice today, so I let it go. So, ask me how my day went. How did your day go, Cyril? My day was pretty good, thanks for asking. Um, um, I woke up at 8.30. I went down in the tent, fell asleep, took Jay to work. And then I went grocery shopping with my parents and bought a ten box of macaroni, some amazing strawberry banana smoothie juice, a amp energy drink. Then we left and went to Walmart to get me some work shoes because I'm going to have a job soon. <sighs> a real job. At Culver's. Butter burgers. Would you like a butter burger? Because Goodwill didn't want me anymore. I don't want to get into that. It breaks my heart. It really does. I call and call. Went to the interview. I did amazing. She loved me. I I loved her. You know, she was pretty, and I just I couldn't wait to see her face every day. I'm just kidding. Where am I? But anyways, so after uh, we got myself some work shoes for Culver's, um, I went back home and then put our food away from the grocery store. And then we went to Hula Hands and I had some shrooms. And um, a hamburger and some French onion soup, which is very good, by the way. I just hate when that cheese just gets so chewy and it just feels like it's going to go down your throat and you're going to choke to that. But it's just so good. You just want to get all that cheese in your mouth. But it's just so much cheese. You're just like, <gasps> I'm going to die. i got to spit this back out. i gotta got to, like, chew my cheese. But instead, I just love for it to go down. But sometimes you'd kill yourself. I mean, I haven't really heard of a person that died eating French onion soup, but I really do think there should be um someone watching you while you eat that because uh it can be kind of dangerous. It really could, you know. But after that, uh we came home again to drop off my dad because my dad was drunk. And then my mom and me and my mama, me and my mom, my mama, my, mama, my mumu, my mother. We uh went to Kohl's and I got a hundred dollars worth of clothing. Well, actually, it was like 118, but we got 50 percent off, which was only like a hundred dollars. And I got this new shirt. Even though I look really fat in it, cause I'm fatty, bloated. Uh, and a bra, which my boobies look awful and awesome. And then, oh shit, is my hair messed up? Has I been looking ugly this whole time? Has I? Has I? Is that even a word? Or is that even the right phrase? Has I? Have I? I mean, have. H A V E spelled have. Did I win the spelling bee? I don't know. Okay, anyway. Then. Then, after that, we went to Target to get some. Uh, Pens, like school supplies. I really fucking want, excuse my language, beep, beep, beep that out. I really did want the Adidas shoes. You know, the Adidas sandals, like the normal, like, ones that are, like, black, you know, and, like, are, like, squishy, and, um, they Velcro, and, you know, the ones that are, like, cool, like, all the preps wear them. Where the fuck do you get them? Because I'm looking all over the goddamn place. God can't see it really makes me mad because I look everywhere but I can't find them it's like all the other Adidas kind of shoes out there which are ugly as heck 
I'm not planning on running a few hundred yards, so I don't need those tennis shoes. I need the flip flops. Damn it, what the fuck? Sorry, I'm getting very mad. This show has been adult version in the past four minutes. But, so then, went on the computer for a while. And then I came to Red Lobster waiting for Jay because I figured he'll be out soon. But, oh yeah, I missed a part. I got home, and I went into the tent, and he left the door of the tent open. He left the whole thing open. It was open for uh, who knows how many hours. Seven hours open. I was like, when we got in the car to take him to work, I was like, did you close the tent? And he's like, yeah. And I, I believed him kind of common sense to close the fucking tent, you know, but I go in there and it's flies, and we spilled so many sodas in there that there's probably ants underneath the blankets and spiders, those big ones that were all over the place, but only on the outside. They probably found their way in because of that huge thing that's open, you know. Boys are stupid. <laughs> What the fuck is this? They were all in love with dying and they were doing it in Texas. Holly caught a bullet, but it only Songs nowadays, they just are no talent at all. No talent at all. Do you hear this song? Well, there's a little singing part, but I'll make up my own song, okay? So one day, I woke up, and I decided to go for a drive. I come to the big lobster place, the big red lobster place. I sit in my car, bored as hell. I sit in my car and sing a little song. I sit in my car and sit on the floor. I listen to the music go in my eardrums. It burns, it hurts, it really doesn't sound good. But I love to sing a little song. All the songs on the radio suck. They can suck on my... duck. But... I will sing my own little song. Because I am... awesome. The clouds in the sky will make you die. If you cry, don't cry, or you die, because clouds in the sky will kill you tonight. Hi, is your hair nappy? Well... I can solve that for you. You need to get the Revlon brush. It has the bristles that you like in your your um velcroy brushes, and they also have the plastic brush bristles that um go through your hair. And it's like a really nice soft brush that gets every strain of hair, and it's just like it feels so good brushing your hair. So, it's $5 at a Walgreens near you. You should get it today. Uh, I hope you enjoyed listening to my day. Thanks for watching. Um, July 26, 2009. I'm Sarah Marie Raver, and I'm heading out. And I'm heading out. And I'm heading out!